Hey guys, we're live. It's Kathy Bowes Crafting Show, where I'll do just about any kind of crafting. That's right. And um, I'm having I'm having a hair day, y'all. Don't look at it. Okay, okay. Um, I got something really cool to show you today. So I'm waiting on a couple of use guys, use guys to come in. So come on, park anywhere. It's free. Mm-hmm. I'm going to show you a little something we made Tuesday night and tell you about some fun stuff. And it is a minute after. So I think we're just going to go ahead and get started. And I hope you guys will join in. All right. So now we're at my desktop. We are going to make a card with watercolors on watercolor paper, special ink to hold this image, and what else? Um, I don't know. So anyway, I saw this um, probably on the demonstrator planning place. Hey, Gloria, I'm so glad you're here. Um, I think that's where I saw this card, and I'm hoping I'll make it somewhat like it should look, you know? Okay, um, now the reason I'm focusing on cards and images from Stampin' Up! right now is because, y'all, this is going away. Um, next Thursday is the last day to get a free item out of this brochure with a $50 purchase. And, hey Marilyn, and y'all know, well, if you saw me Tuesday night, you'll know I'm giving this stamp set free to somebody, um, everybody who places a $50 order with me before tax and shipping is going to go into a drawing for this stamp set. You really can't get it unless you have a $150 order. So it's free to you guys. Um, hey, Christina, I hope you're feeling better. So y'all, I'm going to give this away separate from your order. Like if you order a $50 order, 50 or more, I'll put a drawing in for this set, okay? And everybody who orders from me by September 30th is going to get 10 free handmade cards from me. And one really fortunate person is going to get those 10 cards plus this. Yay! See, so everybody wins. Everybody wins. Okay, so hey, Heather. Um, so yeah, that's why I'm showing y'all celebration stuff. Um, oh, Christina, so good to know. She's pretty tired today, but not in pain. So she's grateful. Christina's recovering and, um, and I'm very thankful to, to see you on here, my friend. Um, so yeah, that's why I'm showing y'all celebration stuff because I don't want you to miss it. Hey, hey, Teresa. If you guys miss this and on um, October 1st, you're like, you know what? I really liked that paper. I'll be like, so sorry. So sorry. It's gone. Okay. And that, that's what happens. That's, I, don't, I don't know where it goes, y'all. I don't know if they've got like a special place. If they, you know, send it to the border. I, did I just say that out loud? I, I don't know where it goes. Okay. Um, this feels like home. I have no idea why I brought this one. Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. I used the designer series paper, um, on Tuesday night from the, um, from these little, oh, come on now, from these little penguins. Okay. I used this Tuesday night to make this, this card. Isn't it cute as a button? Yeah. So what I did, y'all, I also used the, um, the trees, old poo, can't remember the name right off, but anyway, uh, festive trees or something like that, and I did all them, but then this guy, and this guy, and this guy, I cut out of the designer series paper, which is, hello, free, while supplies last, okay? Now, let me say this, too. Let's say that you just love that penguin paper. And you're placing a $50 order and it's sold out because that will happen at some point. Um, or it should. Then um, just let me know. Pick out something else. Oh, hey, Hopper. Pick out something else. And then um, 
when you pick out something else, I'll send you a six by six uh, selection of that paper. How about it? Because I happen to have a little extra. All right, so this is 140 pound water paper, watercolor paper, but I can lift it. Um, Gloria, gonna order the penguin bundle. Okay, well, go ahead and order, and if it's on back order, it will ship to you when it gets out. If it is not orderable, you have to wait. But I would go ahead and put it on my order, and they ship it to you, and they don't charge you extra shipping or anything. So it's it's a win-win. All right, so yeah, I just used my Tim Holtz Distress Sprayer. You're not in distress when you use this. It's okay. You're just using it to distress, okay? But we're not even distressing. We're just, we're just doing it. You know what I should have done first, y'all? Hold on. Believe it or not, I, I sort of kind of halfway might know what I'm doing. Okay, let's just cut this and make it a little easier to navigate. Why did I have such a big piece? Because when I mess up, y'all, I can start over. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yep. Ninja Man's home. He just got back from a doctor appointment and he went to the grocery store. Y'all, we are laying low. I have two very important things to do in um, in November. And, I, man, I, the first one is like, have to, have to. My girls, um, my girlfriends and I, we meet to craft once, uh, I'll start to say once a month. Um, we meet to craft um, in a little chalet. And anyway, it's it's just the best thing ever. Um, and I, I'm not going to miss it. The second one is a bunch of people that I don't know, and I'm just a little anxious about it. Um, but not fearful. I want to be full of discernment. I'm not fearful. God does not give us the um, the spirit of fear, y'all. Promise y'all. Um, yeah, I need y'all too, Christina. Well, I will be there. I will. This set here feels like home. It is in here, and it's free. Oop, hold on. It must be right there or there. No? Okay. Yeah, I'm 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 trying to find it, y'all. I was prepared. I really was, but I was also taking a nap. So there's that. Here it is. Feels like home. This is the set. It's free. It's a freebie with a $50 purchase. <clears throat> and to my knowledge, it's ready and waiting for you. All right, now I don't know how this is going to work because really maybe I should have stamped it first. We'll see. But I am just going to... This is why I have extra, y'all. And some of y'all are watercolor gurus. Well, let me tell you, I am so not a watercolor guru. Now, I'm using Stazon ink because I use this for things like watercolors. See, I wrote it on there. Hopper says, I ain't scared of no host. <laughs> I ain't scared of no ghost. Okay, this thing smells like cherries. I, I mean, I don't, I'm not saying like I want to smell it a whole lot, but it doesn't smell too bad. Now I'm going to stamp it and we're going to see um, Gloria waiting on a phone call for the transplant hospital for some necessary meds my son needs. No pharmacy has it and they're looking for it. Oh, goodness. Yes, I will be praying for that, Gloria. My goodness. Nyoka, hey, hey, girl. Hey, Nyoka. Okay, so let it's a little light. I'm going to try it over here and then spray it. How about that? Yeah, y'all be praying for Gloria. Um, Her son needs some medicine that it's hard to find. And God knows right where that medicine is and how to get it. Goodness, y'all. Okay, we're going to try this again. I'm going to just, you know, I should and I might have to go back and use my, um, no, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I started saying I might have to go back and use my Stamparatus, Stamposaurus. So this is the image. Boop. I think I'll bring y'all even closer. Boop. Because I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be, um, 
color in it, okay? I don't know what's going to happen, but here we go. Boop, boop, boop. There we go. Okay. I mean, it's watercolor paper. Let's do watercolor, right? All right. And, um, oh, oh, this is kind of neat. Like, I barely touch it in it because these are watercolor pencils. Yep, yep. Yes. I barely touch it and the color just springs to life. Oh, my goodness. Um, these pencils are from Stampin' Up. They can go in your little order. You can pick whatever you want for $50. And then get you some freebies. But um, like I was saying, I did get this stamp set from uh, somebody online. And I, I wish I had gotten her name, but I didn't. But I believe it was in our Stampin' Up! Um, Facebook group one of our Stampin' Up! Facebook groups. I'm going to give it yellow, um, yellow little grippy things here. I don't know why, but I want it to have yellow ones. How about that? And a yellow, no, nah, let's do a brown seat. Um, here's the little box that the, that the colors come from. Um, oh, I will tell Ninja Man, hey, hey, he just got back from the grocery store and the doctor. Um, these are the boxes they come come in, and maybe this one now comes in a black box. I don't know. I taped this to it because, you know, every time I'm doing watercolors, I end up looking for a way to um, sharpen my little pencils. I know. It's crazy. So I'm just going to put a little color in here. I'm not going to be too, too fancy with my green. That's not a pretty green. Let's try that one again. Maybe this one's better. Oh, dear, y'all. Oh, I might have. Now, I did bring another set of watercolors over here just in case something crazy happens because I don't want to be trying to sharpen these live and in person simply because sometimes they don't, they don't act, act right. Watercolor pencils don't act right when you, when you do that. Okay, so we're just, you know, like I'm not getting exact and you'll see. You'll see, I'm just putting some color on, you know, just kind of like this because it it's just enough. It's just enough to put just a little bit of color on. And um, here we go. We have a little tree by the door. All right. Now, let's put a little, we'll put a little pink in here. Just put some, maybe there's flowers in here and see it kind of. It kind of looks a little like maybe there's flowers and there's a basket of flowers here. When when he came when she came over to give her friend flowers, she didn't know she already had a basket full of the same ones. It's okay. It's okay. She wasn't embarrassed. She was just like, well, that that's just me. That's how I roll. I, I didn't know she had those flowers. So, you know. And now the tree might get some yellow in it. It might. It might. Let's see. Oh, yeah. The tree definitely gets some yellow. Yellow. I mean, this is not going to take any time, y'all. Um, if you came in late, this is what we made on Tuesday night. It's super cute. Nyoka says she loves to watercolor. Not good at it, but like to play. Oh, it, it, you will see. I mean, I'm just like... And, y'all, I have a tough act to follow. My daughter is a trained artist, and I'm talking about this... This girl can, whew, she is a honest to goodness artist with a, you know, artist studio and clients and all that stuff. Um, but the kind of knowledge she has isn't the kind that you just kind of spill over to your mom. <laughs> it's like if your daughter was like a, a doctor or something, you know, you'd, you'd probably be like, take this, don't, I mean, she'd be like, take this, don't take that, you know, and that's about it, but you couldn't go do brain surgery, so that's where I am, she's like, well, those are, those are good watercolor pencils, you know, they're not, they're not the highest end, because that's not what Stampin' Up! is about, we're crafters, we're not trying to, you know, be the best of the best, now, I, I don't even know if I should do this, but here I go, aha, we know where she got, she took it all, too, my friend, took it all. I don't know if I should do that, but I just did it. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna do his little wheels. Oh, dear. Oh, y'all, when you put color, when you put water on there, 
this stuff just comes right out. I mean, who knew? Well, I guess I did, but I don't know. Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Here we go around the wheel. Let's get that. Oh, dear. The wheel. Well, that that's that little air thingy that you have to blow the wheel up with. Mm -hmm. That's what that is. I planned it. Not really. Okay. Um, we need, we need, we need the fender. The fender. There we go. Because we got that fender. All right. Um, this one is a gray. And I think I'll just do this and this just to give it some, I don't know, whatever. But I do like the teal bicycle. Okay. Now it's about to get real. All right. We're just going to start putting some, we're going to start putting some brown in here. We're going to put some brown. And we need to blot a little bit because it's getting crazy. Okay. Okay. So, y'all, um, my nails are from Color Street. I mean, I'm not, I'm not really good at it anymore. I, the first few I did, I was really good at it, but um, but this one I just kind of like just put it on before my live um, Tuesday, and here we are. So um, yeah, so I'm going a little darker on the bottom of these bricks, and um, just to give it some shadow. I think I don't know, I don't know why. I'm just doing it. Maybe the gray, maybe the door is going to be gray. Or maybe, what if it's a red door? That might be fun. Y'all tell me what color you think the door should be. I've got pink and teal and yellow and gray and blue. And I've got pretty much all the colors. Um, so let's narrow it down to a yellow door, a gray door, or a red door. Or oh, well, I don't think we should do green because there's so much green in this already. All right. Or we could do a brown door. We could. I'm not, I'm not, you know, not too choosy. And I'm getting our little baskets. Getting little baskets colored in. Um, for the longest time, I had a bicycle basket on the floor of my bathroom, um, which, which held little magazines. And um, it was fun. What in the world? That's crushed curry. That's like a yellow. I think I'll add some of him in here. Yeah. It looks brown, doesn't it? But it's not. It's not. Okay, we've got... Um, oh, Nyoka's having some health issues. Oh, girl, I'll be praying for you as well. Um, oh, Hopper says give it colorized black and white picture look. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. Um... Yes, pray for Nyoka and Gloria as well. Red door, blue would be pretty. All right, I've got a black and white. I got a red and a blue. I need something to break that up so we'll know. We'll know what we want to do. I don't think that yellow is is doing it, y'all. Okay, here we go. I got a different. Oh dear. Oh, see, that's some of the things I deal with in my life. There we go. So, yeah, y'all. So, um, we are, once again, we're just kind of staying home and out of the way. Um, our area here is really, really bad. And we're not, we're not going to camp out on that today. But um, I just want y'all to know, you know, it, it's kind of, it's kind of uh, difficult sometimes. You know, this is not what we pictured retirement to be at all. All right, y'all, I'm going to try and sharpen it. I hate to do that on live TV, but here we go. Because this little thing is a pain, and it doesn't work well for me. Yeah, it doesn't work that well. But I got a little bit. Oh, that, that, I don't like that. Um, come back in with the brown. We'll go with a lighter brown. We'll just kind of very barely put brown on there. Okay, there we go. Just a little brown. Let's see what we have. Red door, blue. Hmm. All right. All right. We could do a black door. We could. Okay, so we're just kind of... Now, the girl um, that did this before, 
she actually, her bricks went all the way out like this. So I'm just certain she drew them on. And I don't, I, I just don't want to put y'all through that. <laughs> just don't want to put you through it. Don't. Um, and I don't know if fall has hit your house, y'all. But I'm telling you, last night we were sitting out on the porch. And Ninja Man, when, when he does a porch up, he's got these real pretty lights around the edge of the of the roof line there and um and they just you know he can control if they're dark or light or whatever where's that other one i guess this is it and um and anyway he's he had his little lights on out there and i had a prayer group that i meet with on wednesday nights online and we went we usually go 30 minutes because we have very specific time frames that we allow ourselves. Um, and anyway, I went out there and y'all, it was cold. I, I had to take my sweater outside. I did. I was like, what is up with that? It's the first day of fall. But then my friend says it, it might be a pretend fall. We might be right back up in those high temps here in Georgia. And I'm in kind of southwest Georgia. Okay, so we got that done. Oh, dear. Hold on. Hold on. Who in the world? Here we go. I left this part right here, just like nobody cares about that side. Oh, yeah. I got a new welcome mat. I put it right here in front of my door. And, um... Nyoka says, it's nice here with beautiful sunshine. Here, too. Uh, Heather, it was 62 this morning. It's supposed to be 57 tomorrow. Woohoo! I haven't even looked at the weather, but I expect we're going to, you know, we're going to get at least what Savannah area gets. It's usually a little cooler here than Savannah. Um, but anyway, um, what was I telling y'all? I don't know. I was telling y'all something. Okay, here we go. I'm just going to go above the door a little bit because don't you think the, the house kind of goes up this way? I do. I do. Unless it's a little hobbit house. Okay, okay. Y'all, I'm going to... I think I'm going to do a red door. I think I'm going to do a red door. Gloria has 67 there. Um. Yeah, yeah, we'll have another heat wave before the end of the month. Um. Yeah, but yeah, so we sat on the porch last night and I had to go get my sweater and it was so nice. And um, Ninja Man and I have a few little decisions we're making. I mentioned some of those on Tuesday. Um, we're, we're deciding that maybe maybe we just don't want to, we just don't want to travel for a long time. We don't know. Um, just, it's just, you know, lately it's just a lot and... We um we went on vacation back in oh the door's about to be blue didn't I say red ah the coral front door mm. well now now the door's blue I just picked up blue and went with it y'all and I I kind of like that it's not just solid it's got some little variation in it um but yeah we we're, we're about deciding that maybe maybe we just don't want to travel. For a while, because this mess doesn't look like it's going away very soon. Had some friends that were traveling, um, <clears throat> excuse me, to Europe, and it was a it was a big trip, and it has just canceled. I mean that you can I I don't know, but I guess you can travel to Europe, but the area they were going in, it was best to not. And y'all, it's just like Second uh, Corinthians uh, somewhere. God heal our land. If if we if we pray that God will heal our land, y'all, He's going to heal it. You know, sometimes His healing is the other side of heaven, but you know, not this side. But that's okay too, right? Y'all, I'm kind of liking just this, like it, like they painted it blue when it was brand new, but then some of the paint chipped off, and and they really didn't care. And this is where you know when they unlock it. And they push it with their shoe. That's that's that little spot right there. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now I'm going to go around the door frame, which could be another color, but let's not get too crazy. All right. 
we're just going to do this to the door frame. And now one thing about watercolor, color, I mean watercolor paper, <laughs> water paper color, one thing about this paper is it, you know, it gets wet. And I mean, it, it bubbles a little bit. So, you know, I, I would have to consult the real artiste to find out how to avoid that, right? And I kind of, kind of, I think we're going to make this pot red so we can have some red in here for my friends who like the red door. Um, we can make this little pot right here red. Oh, yes. It needs to be bold red. Matter of fact, we can make this one red over all that brown I did. Boop. There we go. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, now in betweens, let me see, where's the gray? This is a purple. And the gray. I know it's right here in front of me. Please hold. Your call is important to us. That's black. Um, um, um here it is. It was on the end of the row. I guess it's being bad. We're just gonna put a little gray in here. Just just a wee bit, not a lot. And I'm I'm just gonna give just a little little gray in the windows. Just a wee. All right, okay, now how to flatten it out? I don't know, I don't know y'all, but I'll tell you this, we are going, now see that's all colored, okay? It's all, it's so pretty. Do y'all like it? Isn't it pretty? I like it, I do. Could it be a little bit better here and there? Oh, sure, it could. Like maybe if I finish the porch, <laughs> excuse me, and then maybe if I put a little something in that planner, and maybe if I come back with the yellow, which has escaped, the yellow's like, no, I'm not doing it. Cool, yeah. See, I'm just I'm just scribbling, y'all, but it but it puts the colors, you know, you know, you know. Oh, Nyoka, you know, I do that all the time. It's like when I when somebody asks me something by text message and they say, do you know blah, blah, blah? And then I'll say, please hold. And I'll put all the music stuff on there. Um, oh, Karen's here from the teacher's lounge. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I always, I always, um, like, even if people call me, like, from a uh, doctor or somebody like that, I'll be like, please hold. Your call is important to us. Sometimes I say, press one if you'd like a meatloaf. And that usually, they're like, what? I didn't know I could get a meatloaf. <laughs> yeah, it, it's a party all day long with me, Nyoka. I'll tell you what. Okay, so here's here's what I pulled out. First of all, these are, these are retired, y'all. But this is why you buy stuff. Because you end up with all this, you know? And you're like, I can use that. So I might use it. I might not. I might not. These are the rectangle ones, which I might use those. I'm kind of wanting to try these brand new ones. They are called scalloped contour dies. And let me just see here. Let me just see. Oh, I have no idea how if, if it's going to be too frou frou -y or if we're going to like it or what. But you know what we might be able to do? We might. We just might. Oh. Yep, look at this, like that, or maybe, let me see if I like it better this way, put the, come on now, these rectangle dies, y'all, they stay on top of the stack because I use them all the time. I think I like it better like that, so it looks kind of like a picture frame. That's what we're going to do. Um, yeah, my shape dies never, never do I part with them. And Karen, yes, these dies, I'm so excited about them. So y'all know what's next. We got the big shot. Mr. Big Shot, who do you think you are? Mr. Big Shot, you're never going to get my love. See, y'all didn't know. Y'all did not know the limits to my talents. Boop. <laughs> my talents are very limited, let me tell you. Let me tell you. All right. 
Th this is a hot mess because all of this part broke right here and it, it just kept falling to the floor and it finally, and my husband was like, oh no, because the last time it did it, he was standing there. And I said, no, don't worry. That's a hot mess coming through all the time. So you did not break it. It's been trying to be broke for a long, long time. We're just going to trim this bad boy up right here. And and yes, I'm at, I'm at the other desk, y'all. So I just, I have different tools over here. Except for this guy. He came with me. He came with me today. Hey, you stopped loving her today. They placed a wreath upon his door. And soon they'll carry him away. He stopped loving her today. Don't ask me. Don't even ask me why. But <laughs> that song, y'all. George, what's his name? I cried first time I heard it because it was in the 80s and we didn't have anything to distract us, you know, and things like that would make me cry. But now it's like, uh-uh, I've seen the news. I'm not going to cry anymore. Um, <laughs> oh, my goodness. But that was kind of cute, wasn't it? He stopped loving her. And then you're like, oh, he got over her. Nope, 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 died. Died, died. Oh, hey, Robin. Uh, let's see. Nyoka, I'm beginning to wonder about your talent. Crafter, cabaret, singer, author, and comedian. Yes, add to cart. Just put your quarters in right on the side, right there. Yes, yes. Um, I actually did a speaking engagement last Tuesday. And y'all, let me tell you about that. Okay, my speaking engagements, I, I share funny stories. I share heartfelt stories. And I definitely share um, my faith. And I'm a Christian. And um, just, I mean, you know, like, here I am. Oh, George Jones. Thank you. Yes, George. George. Um, and and I like to, um, I, I, ju I just love to let them know what God has done in my life, y'all. Um, and I mean, I didn't like find myself under a bridge one day and an angel came. None of that. It's just the regular stuff. You know, you're just doing your thing. Now I'm going to put this like this, y'all. I'm going to put this like this and, and, and cut it out. Um, yeah, you're just doing your thing and, and you know, your, your world falls apart. And, and I'm telling you, God has been there through all of it. But anyway, so I did this speaking engagement Tuesday night and, um, Everybody there, well, there were men in the crowd, which is fine, but you know, you gotta, you gotta really work hard to keep the men's, men's attention. Okay. And I was a little anxious afterwards. I thought, gosh, I hope I did well because it's, it's a lot of money. And when they, when they book me, right. And I, I'm not bragging at all. I promise you, but it's not something that you just, they give you a cookbook and you go home. So, you know, I need to give them a legitimate something. So I was just like, oh dear, I hope, I hope I did well. And I hope that I, I told them I was going to share, uh, share the gospel and I was going to share my faith. And, and they said, that's awesome. So that's what happened. And, um, lady called me yesterday, I think. And she's like, that was so wonderful. And I'm like, oh, thank you. Thank you. It made me feel really good. So it, you know, it's a, it's a part of my income, but stamping up is my fun stuff. Well, I mean, I, I have fun speaking too. I really do. But it's so funny every time lately, every time I get home and I'm thinking of the stress of putting it all together and getting the right clothes and getting the hair and the makeup and all that done and, and going and doing, then I'm just like, you know what? I'm, I'm not doing this anymore. That very evening, I get an email from my agent in Atlanta. And I immediately said, of course I will. <laughs> Y'all, that happened. And I'm like, I thought I wasn't going to do this anymore. <laughs> right? Okay, I got to go get my glue. Please hold. Oh, my goodness. And my sweater, y'all, is sweater weather. Sweater weather. Let's see what we got in here. Let's see what we got in here. Okay, I had to open a new glue, y'all, because, um, and yes, I'm wearing, y'all, I want to show you what I'm wearing. 
I don't even know what this is, but it's it's this, and I, that's what today is all about. Okay, I'm just I'm just in here crafting and having a good time. Let me. What are what happened? Oh, I know what happened. Please hold. This is a glass desk, y'all, and you're seeing through to a drawer. You see my drawer? Yeah. And that's why I like to keep it just a wee bit lower. Hold on. Come on. Oh, dear. Okay, well, well, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. So I brought three adhesives. Okay. Boop. And because it's watercolor, but it's flattening out rather nicely, y'all. I'm telling it to behave. Let's see. Um, George Jones, yes. Nyoka, you never know whose heart you're touching, even if it's just... Oh, and that, yeah, she said, um, she told me, she said there were tears, and I was like, oh my goodness. Oh, <sighs> Nyoka, God says, don't tell me what you are and aren't going to do. Right, right, girl, you are on it. You are on it. Yes, God is gliding, is guiding me for his glory. Yes, ma'am. And doing it for the Lord, you need to do it. It's for God's glory. Yes, thank you. Thank you, y'all. I, I agree. I agree. And, you know, the the whole thing is, I, I have such joy in that because it's a secular group. Um, if it's, if it's a church group or something, um, like, okay, one time it was, oh gosh, a lot of people. There was a lot of people and it was, um, in the Savannah, some place in Savannah, I don't remember. And I just did comedy and clean, you know, clean comedy and stuff like that. And I thought after I left, you know, man, I should have, I should have um, been better prepared to share, share the word of God. And I, and I wasn't. And after that, I was like, Lord, you know, you, you tell me what you want me to do with this. Cause he gave it to me. He gave me my goofiness. And that's where we are. Okay, y'all. So here we have a really pretty card. And we might, we might. Missing you. I'm always forever here for you. Your friendship feels like home to me. I can't thank you enough. Hmm. I think, I think just a sweet little missing you right there. But we, we don't know how this is going to go, y'all. Don't. We don't. We don't, I don't like to, I don't like to stamp after I've already done all the things, especially like this. So please hold, I'm going to grab one more thing. My Stamposaurus, or Stamparatus, whatever you want to call it. And, come on now. Okay, I don't need y'all. I'm coming back. Don't, don't be worried. Don't be nervous. I'm here. I'm here. Okay, so I want to show y'all, um, I went crafting with some, at a friend's house, and there's, there's only like one, two, three, four, five of us, and we have a very large space. Anyway, we did make these to go with the, the, um, Misty's and the Stamparatuses. Um, thank you, Nyoka, and, and whoever made this first gets the credit, but hers is a lot, is a lot different. Um, but I got the idea from somebody else. But, um... We had, these are the, um, the Yankee Candle clear jar lids, whatever, and you can pull the plastic off, or maybe it's under here, I don't want to pull it apart, and, and it's a hole, and you put glitter and glue down in there, and you get this, and then you put, this is a, um, it's one of those floor pads for, like, chair feet or tables or whatever to keep it from scratching your floor. You put that on there and then use an E6000, we put a piece of felt. All right. Same principle as the one I first made for myself. Different. It's not Yankee. It's somebody else. And I used the floor thing and the, the felt. So, you know, I got two of them because sometimes you just need two, right? I guess. All right. Let me get our, um, I have our magnets right here. They're, they store here and here. And I've got washi tape on them because they are difficult to pick up if you don't show them who is boss. I'm going to put one there. I'm going to put one here. 
And they cannot be together, y'all. I've told you that before. They fight like cowboys and Indians. Can we still say cowboys and Indians? I don't even know. I don't even know. All right, so I'm going to go. I'm going to show y'all how this how this works if I if I can. I got one more thing. One more thing, y'all. One more thing to grab. One more. That's the problem with working over there. You know? You know? You know? Okay, I got a little piece of vellum because I don't want to... I don't want this thing to be crooked. So I'm just going to put my little piece of vellum right there. I think I'm just going to stick him down with this. Okay. Then I'm going to pick this up. I could put some uh, ink on it. Like this. Um very pretty oh goodness robin you love these little you're talking about the little um handle things robin are you talking about these i love it too i love it too she did a um my friend that i was visiting she did one in red and two in blue all right i'm just seeing it is it's pretty straight y'all you see how you see how i did that oh hey carol um, Carol made some for Lady Crafters, needed extra lids, bought some jars at Dollar Tree for some of the Chuckies. Yes, it's called a Chucky tool because, um, let me just move my card just a wee. I hope, I hope I did that well. Um, it's called a Chucky tool because, um, Gina K, who is a big, uh, stamp company, all this stuff anyway, but she's also just Gina K. That's her name. Um, she was demonstrating, um, some techniques and a friend of hers named Chuck saw that she was going like this, trying to, trying to work that right. Oh, y'all look, I do like this. I like it a lot. Um, so she, she, he saw her struggling a little bit and she has some arthritis in her wrist. I think she said, so he made her this, this tool that you can hold and just go like that. And y'all, it is a game changer. Like I'm, I'm all always, when I start to make multiple cards, I get all this out and I've got my, I've been using this, you know, and I, and I love using it. It just makes my life easy y'all. Easy, easy, easy. So I want to tell you all a few things again. Um, right here, use this September host code if you would like to order. Um, this code is good until the 30th. And don't forget celebration. Boop. Celebration. Boop. Free with a $50 purchase. And that's before tax and shipping. And what else? Oh. What else is this? And I am going to give away 10 cards, 10 handmade cards for everybody that places an order between now and September 30th. And somebody is going to win this stamp set. And you generally have to buy $150 worth of product to get it. So um, it's brand new. It's never been used. And, um, and, and here we go. Here we go. It'll it'll come to you if you are ordering. And I mean, why wouldn't you order? You get free stuff, y'all. Free stuff. Something free for every $50. Okay. And of course, my website is, oh dear, that's not it. There it is. Um, KathyBow.StampinUp.net. And these items will come separately. If you're the winner of the stamp set, I will mail that to you. And also whoever orders uh, with the 10 cards, I will send those from me. Everything else comes from Stampin' Up. So here we go, our little card. I hope y'all love it. Hope you like it. It was fun to make. It was fun to share with y'all. And I got one more next Thursday. We're going to look at um, Celebration again. And I hope, I hope I'm not telling you everything's sold out. So um, if you need to do a screenshot, there's my September host code. All right. Thank y'all so much. And, um, and listen, God did not give us the spirit of fear. It says it nowhere, nowhere in the Bible does it say that God gave us fear. Okay. He gave us discernment, but he did not give us fear. 
He can take it away though. All right. So y'all be, um, y'all be safe and be happy. And I will be praying for the prayer needs that came up while we were uh, visiting today. All right. So God bless y'all. Thanks for coming by. Toodles.